Hi, I'm the Smoking Elk, and this is my barbecue beans. Sweet, sticky, smoky barbecue beans. They're the perfect accompaniment, perfect side dish for any barbecue, and I'm gonna show you how I make mine. First thing we're gonna do is crack on a slice up some onions. You can see I've got a huge array of ingredients here, and every one of these ingredients is gonna to go towards making those beans the best beans you've ever tasted. So the first thing we need to do is dice a couple of onions. So we're just gonna finely dice two onions and we're gonna slice up a red chilli. Once these are sliced, diced, we're gonna bring over the barbecue and I'm gonna show you exactly how we build the dish. So I've got a Dutch oven on the coals. We haven't got it screaming hot yet because the first thing we wanna do is render down the bacon. So you start with a cold pan and as it warms up, it's gonna help that bacon fat render out nicely. So in that goes. And this is gonna take about five or six minutes. We want the bacon to crisp up slightly, a load of that fat to come out. And then we're gonna crack on, sweat down some onions, stick in a few bowls of garlic that I've crushed and some chilies. So the onions have been sweating down for about 10 minutes now. We're ready to start building the rest of the dish. So I'm gonna go in with some bourbon. You don't have to add this, but I'm gonna, why not? I love a bit of bourbon. So we're gonna go in with about 50 ml of bourbon, a little bit left in there, sod it. That's the bourbon. Then we want some spices in there. We wanna start building these flavors. So we've got sumac. We're gonna go in with about a teaspoon or so of sumac. Same again of paprika, about a teaspoon and coriander, again, a teaspoon. Already smelling that bourbon hitting me, making me want one, to be honest. So, that's the spices. We're gonna go in with a pinch more salt. We put some salt in earlier on just to help uh, the onions sweat down, help release the moisture from the onions. So, a little touch more salt. Got some beans, of course. We're using three different types of beans here. You can use whatever beans you fancy. I'm using cannellini, using haricot, and we are using kidney beans. They're all gonna offer slightly different tastes and slightly different textures. We, of course, want some juice in there. So I've got about 500 ml of passata that we're just gonna pour into there, like so. And of course, if are not barbecue beans, without barbecue sauce. So use your favorite barbecue sauce. Remember, different barbecue sauces are gonna give you different flavors. I think for these beans, this bullseye chipotle, smoky chipotle barbecue sauce is an absolute winner with these beans, so um, that's my favorite, I'm going with it. So we're gonna go in with about 200 ml of this barbecue sauce. So in that goes. And now we're just gonna give that a quick stir to combine. And straight away, they are starting to look absolutely glorious. So they're gonna blip away now for around about an hour if they look like they're getting a little bit dry, you can maybe put a little bit of stock in there, maybe a little bit of water. Cook them to the desired consistency, whatever consistency you're after. I'm also gonna pop in a cinnamon stick just to add another tiny little dimension of flavor. I'm also gonna stick some fresh herbs in there. Trust me, putting fresh herbs into these beans really does work, so give it a go. I'm using rosemary and sage that I'll pick from the garden, so I'm just gonna take the rosemary off of the stalks and I'm just gonna finely chop these herbs up and then into the mix they go. And lastly, just gonna finish with about half a teaspoon of pepper. And that is it, give it another stir, and we're just gonna let this simmer away for about an hour, and we'll come back and see how we've done them. So here we are, an hour in, the beans are done, and they smell incredible, so I'm just gonna pop this lid off and see how we've done. They are looking mighty damn fine to me. So all we're gonna do with these, like I said, these make a fantastic side dish to any barbecue, be it brisket, be it ribs, be it wings. You can even stick them on a burger if you fancy it. That's my barbecue beans. I'm the Smoking Elk. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon.